All right, welcome to my backyard. No, this is not Big Bear Lake. We are just gonna give a little update on the channel before we get to those Big Bear clips. Wanna talk about some of the stuff going on and some of the stuff that is gonna go on. Um, as you guys know, um, been about two weeks or so since we've uploaded a good video. Um, we just had to take a break, had some stuff going on, uh, some chores, some projects at the house, some some job changes, just all kinds of stuff in the last few weeks that uh, I had to tend to. So uh, still fishing, still putting all the work in the water, but I uh, just did not want to film to uh, basically avoid having to edit all that stuff. Just, just didn't want to deal with all that right now. But we are back at it, as you guys can see with this video, and uh, we got lots to come. Uh, we got some videos coming out of the Eastern Sierra here real soon. Uh, gonna do some boat rental stuff up there and uh, to show you guys what that's like. In case you guys have wondered, you know, what that's like renting boats up there. Is it worth it? Um, you know, should we even bother? Uh, does it matter on the fishing? So we got some adventures like that coming up real soon. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited for those. And uh, you guys will see those clips uh, pretty soon on the channel here. Uh, but other than that, uh, we are still doing Patreon. So if you guys miss the fishing info that you get from these videos, make sure you guys are stopping by Patreon. Link in the description below. Still doing weekly updates, guys. And um, summer is a tough time to fish here in Southern California. So a lot of people are asking where the fish went. You know, how do we get to the fish? Well, that's where you guys can find that out. In uh, my Patreon link, we do weekly updates and giveaways. We just gave away a Daiwa reel and some other goodies and uh, we are going to continue that uh, so other than that but that's what's going on guys that's why you haven't seen any uploads uh, nothing wrong channel still going strong and uh, we got a lot of stuff coming down the pipe so hopefully you guys are going to join us and uh, let's get to those big bear clips let's uh, take you out to the shoreline of big bear lake at the dam this video is just a it's a shorter video but it is just to show you what it's like fishing early morning at the dam during summer and uh, there are all kinds of tactics that you can use out there slip bobbers water bobbers you can carolina rig it throw spoons um, so you know a lot of options out there in the summertime but this is what it's like out there at the dam all right guys we'll go down to the shore of big bear lake all right good morning from big bear lake you're watching trout west and uh, as you can see we are here at the dam it is super early and uh, they got the pump on uh, we got a cloudy monsoonal day here looks like we might get some thunderstorms up here on the mountain um, not too many people up here today gonna be about 110 112 down in the valley um, I'm thinking that people will probably change their mind and head up the mountain. So probably by the time we're leaving, it'll be pretty packed up here in the Big Bear area. But we got a couple of bait rods out and uh, we're going to stick with bait for a little while. We are prepared to throw some spoons. I got a jig set up. Uh, we're not going to use a surface slip bobber just yet, um, but if the bite gets kind of slow for us and we'll switch it up we know uh, with the slip bobber we will get them but we're trying to kind of get them another way basically uh, lazy basically a Carolina rig on this one over here we're getting the bubble out there um, the purpose of a bubble is to avoid uh, getting stuck on the bottom there's a whole lot of rocks out here at the dam and with the water up um, there's just a whole lot more of them where your bait is gonna be so Anyway, that's going to be the plan. So we got two bait rods out um, and uh, they're rigged with some different baits and we'll see what gets hit first. I suspect we'll see a bite here very soon. I'm uh, probably going to have to switch this one up uh, to something better, but uh, for bait, I just put some white gulp eggs out there when we were pre dawn just to see if we get bit, but uh, it ain't doing anything. So <laughs> we got to switch that one up. but. Uh, otherwise, we are fishing and uh, you guys are coming along for the ride. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Looks like our first bite here. And we'll see what we got. Doesn't feel like he's on there now. Oh, yeah, he's off. 
Looks like the fish was just carrying it away. We'll get it back out there. Let's hit it with some more spray. That's a good sign. We've only been out a few minutes. And uh, already getting bit, so that was a good bite. Guys, this is a nice fish. Very nice fish. That guy. that's going to wrap it up from Big Bear Lake. As you guys can see, it was a pretty good little bite there early in the morning. Uh, we were out there using a bubble uh, tactic. It's not a slip bobber. It's an actual water bobber, they call them, or bubble. Uh, very commonly used for bubble fly. So if you guys Google bubble fly, you'll see what we were doing. But uh, we were having some uh, power bait on the end of that and just kind of casting that over and over. Um, it's only good for uh, basically one or two casts and then the power bait goes flying. It's kind of a hassle way to fish, but something we were just trying out there a little bit different uh, to get a bite. But, you know, uh, the bite up there this time of year changes so fast. So uh, if you guys are heading up there for the summer bite, make sure you guys are switching up tactics. I mean, even by the time this video comes out, um, it's already going to change up there. The bite's going to change. Why? Because the water temperature is changing constantly changing in the summer and uh, with the water temperature change the oxygen levels go down so the hotter it gets less oxygen those fish really uh, change up their eating patterns they change up what depth they're feeding in and uh, it just gets kind of hard for a lot of people up there and uh, that's just the way it is big bear is a tough lake so anyway that's just a couple of clips like i said at the intro we are back at it and we got lots of videos to come lots from southern california we're hitting the eastern sierra soon uh we're gonna do some boat rentals up there and show you what that's like up in the sierra uh as well as some out of state stuff so hopefully you guys are interested and you stick around hit that subscribe button that's how you see all those future fishing videos and uh, if you're interested in more information that's not enough hit me up on patreon link in the description below we're always doing weekly updates over there and uh, giveaways as well. So uh, a lot of fun over there and we will see you guys on the next video. I'm out.